Hello everybody, I am Indy McDaniel and welcome back to The Walking Dead! And last time we found out that they were forcing women to have abortions here because they didn't want any babies. Now we gotta find another tape. I'll go see if I can find something that'll help us get that safe open. Good idea. Okay, that didn't help me at all. Okay, I'm assuming I gotta go back out here. The only thing I can think of... I mean, I know I've got to get into that locker, and I'm pretty sure I know what I'm going to find in the locker. The only thing I don't know... Logan, isn't that the name of the doctor on that tape? Oh. Too bad I don't know the combo. Okay. Uh, fucking cock. Is it... Why would it be back outside? Why would it be back outside? This seems like a terrible idea. But I got a loading screen. So maybe not. Alright. Oh, there's nothing here. Uh, or maybe it's just loaded because I entered a new... area? Not so much that I... One quart. Okay. Damn. Look at barbed wire. I just feel like well, this is the... A fence isn't an option. Yeah, I know. I, I skipped over this entirely and just went straight towards the right fucking call. Herman's auto body. Herman's. This is the place I'm looking for. No, it's not. We already found it. We've already been there. Um. Okay, is there anything else? Uh, no, that's just climbing on the shelf. I'm pretty ah! sure- Oh, fuck! What the shit?! What the hell happened here?! Thanks, TV! <laughs> well, what the fuck was that about? And now I can't even- Okay. That was different. I'm not sure why that happened. Maybe I'm supposed to come over here. Oh! That's right! He's the doctor! Oh yeah, I'm an idiot. Sorry, I'm an idiot. I made that connection and I completely forgot about it. Okay, let's curb stomp a fucking uh, abortion clinic, doctor. <laughs> Done! Molly, I did what you couldn't do. <laughs> Actually get the job done. Alright, let's get a combo. Oh, there it is. Oh, never mind. This might be just what we need. What's this? Looks like some kind of code. But Vernon said the safe combination was only four numbers. Alright. Uh don't Shit. mind me. Time to go. Time to go. Woohoo! Well, that was convenient. Okay, cool. I was supposed to go back out there. I thought that was kind of what he said. It sounded like when I was half listening, that's what it sounded like. Alright, let's assume that it's the combo to this locker. What's in here? Oh, now I just open it. I don't even put a combination in. Safe combination has got to be on one of these. Alright, so we got three tapes. Two that we have not watched yet. Alright. Progress uh, a plenty. I found two more tapes. Hey, that's continuity one flaw right there. Dated October 10th. That's the day after the first one we watched. Put it in. It's gonna be another of uh, the first woman, right? And something bad's gonna happen, I'm sure. Have you made a decision? I thought you said I didn't have a choice. Well, technically you do. You can terminate the pregnancy, or leave Crawford. Of course, that would be a death sentence for both you and your unborn child. Uh, Maybe huh? that's best. I stayed up all last night thinking about this. Why are we even trying to survive? To keep on living, if this is what it takes. If this is what it's turned us into. I don't make the rules, Anna. <laughs> Doctor, I'm begging you. Yeah, but you don't really Please fucking try too hard to day, break the rules or change them, do you? Again. But for now, today, we have to do this. Oh, 
Ooh! You get stabbed. No. No. Is that is that how this all started? Okay. So that's that's how he died, I guess. Know what happened to Crawford? All right. More importantly, we got the combination. Why are you so all bent up out of bent out of shape about this? Is it because you're preggers? Krista, are you all right? What's wrong? It's Who messaging me? That was just hard to watch. Don't worry about me. I'm fine. All right. Let's get those meds and get the hell out of here. All right. We're, We're not watching the third tape. Pretty sure Molly's on that third tape. Take as much of this as we can carry. Okay, I think we're good. This is more than enough for your people and mine. Let's go. You know, I found a third tape in the locker outside. Maybe there's something else on there. We yeah. got the meds for Omid. That's all I care about. We'll head back to the classroom. Don't take too long, Lee. I'm gonna watch the tape, and then Molly's gonna show up and be all pissed. I'm watching it. I want to know. Alright. This might be a bad decision too, but I'm so curious. I just gotta know. Wh what? Listen, as fun as this was, I oh. have to put a stop to this little arrangement. This is the last I can give you. Oh, so what? she was sleeping with well, him. Listen, had someone down here yesterday taking inventory. For drugs? It's really cracking down. I just can't risk it. We had a deal. Yes, we had a deal. We don't anymore. My sister needs this medicine. Oh. Without it, she'll die, or she'll start showing symptoms, and they'll take her away. I can't let that happen. I'm sorry, Molly. I've done all I can, but I have to look out for myself here. Yeah. Uh huh. That's the Crawford way, isn't it? Okay. That wasn't quite as awful as I thought it would be. <laughs> and oh, shit. Molly's standing right behind me. Oh, okay. I would have expected her to walk in in the middle of me watching that. And get pissed off that I knew something about her past. Alright. So she doesn't know I know something about her past. Ooh. Drama, drama. Drama, llama. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Christ. Oh, there she is. Hi. Shit out of me. Where the fuck have you been? Sightseeing. Okay. I'll take that battery now. Oh, yeah. Uh, about that. What did you do? I'm just kidding. Okay, good. Here you go. Thanks. So, do What's you that? only have sex Nothing. for drugs for your sick sister, or? Quit with the act, Molly. I know you're from Crawford. What? Who told you that? I saw you on a security tape. Why'd you lie to me? I said there were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. I never lied to you, and even if I did, so what? I don't owe you anything. You saved yeah. my life twice, but you can't tell me the truth? Are I tell the truth to everyone. Now? I guess that's up to you. I used to live here with my sister. She was 14 years old. When the dead started walking and Crawford shut itself in, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. Mm -hmm. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. Then the rules started coming down. No one who couldn't justify their place or in their keep. No one who required special care. My sister was diabetic, and by Crawford's rules, that made her a liability. God damn you, diabetes! Secret. Kept her safe for as long as I could, but in the end... I couldn't protect her. That's when I got out. Crawford, they always talked about how their system worked. How anything was better than becoming one of them. But I one saw of them. what they already One become. of them! I just wish I could have seen it before it was too late. Before they came and took my sister away. Ha ha! To the funny farm! I'm sorry, this is really sad. I this probably shouldn't have made I a joke. Of her. I didn't have time to take it before I got out of Crawford. 
I just wanted it, okay? It's okay, Molly. I understand. I understand. It's pretty. What the hell? Who's using your trick? Get the hell out of here. Wait, what? Whoa! What the hell was that? Um, fingers on Q and E. We just made a fucking connection. She's gonna die now, right? Oh, Jesus! Chip. Man. What sorry, the fuck, sorry. Ben? I just got spooked by those bells, and then I heard someone coming. Oh, let's Kenny comfort and I Ben for a second. Door open to the armory. He sent me out to look for something we can use to bust it open. I found this. Um. Ben. Ben. Where did you? No. Go? I just found no. It. it was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hall. Oh, you there. dumb fuck! You stupid son of a Molly! No. Okay, you're pretty badass, but careful, careful. Lee, shoot this fucker! Got it. Yay! Come on. So there was a chance she could have died there. Gotta go. Ben, come on. Move your Or or not, whatever. Just make a decision. What the fuck is going on? They're coming. Oh, shit. Ah, so Out that home. time, there was Sir, totally a... Okay, I'm gonna listen. Through the armory. Just <laughs> I might miss important open. information again. Come on, damn you! The, of course, the trick is, now they're gonna this fucking all, kill him. All my fault. What the hell's he babbling about? Ben, we talked about this. No. I saved Carly, I too, in a quick meant. time what do you mean, event. This is all your fault? Penny, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, man. Kid, this ain't the best time. Yeah, Whatever Ben, shut up. Save it for later. Ben, shut the fuck up. Fuck you, Lee. I can't do this anymore. God it's damn it. Me all along, putting all of us in danger. Katja and Duck. It was all me. It was all me. Wait a minute. What are you saying? It was me. Who well, Ben. Deal with thanks. The the thanks for in, fucking us. Them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. And that's when Duck... Uh, 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 not, not the time, Kenny! Yeah, kick his ass later. I agree with you. You should kick his ass! Yeah. not the time. I sided with Kenny on this one. Ben is a fucking asshole. Dad, you hear me? Dad! My wife and child! You gotta both fucking kill! Kenny, listen to me. You can whip his skinny little ass later, but right now we gotta go! We gotta go, Kenny! Nice group you got here. Not the time, Molly. Yeah. If this asshole Just stay alive. on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind! You hear me, shitbird? You can stay behind and fucking rot! Kenny, I know you're upset. I understand. But you don't get to make a decision like that on your own. We're all in this together. We're a group. Sure! Take a vote! This is America! Fuck it! But before Fuck you it. all decide, there's something you ought to know. The boat's not oh. big enough for all of us. Somebody's got to get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here! Not disagreeing with you on any particular point! I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well. But all I want to do is get back to Omi, and you put that at risk. <laughs> I'm sorry, Ben. I got to do what's best for the group. That means cutting you loose. Yep. What about the rest of us? Don't we get a say? <laughs> you don't get a say in shit, lady. <laughs> now can we go? Damn right. Vernon, come on. Come on, Vernon. We need a doctor. We don't need a awful Ben. All right. Well, that seems like a good a place to stop as any, uh, so maybe a tad short for the episode. We got 30 seconds left, but, oh, shit's happening. We actually, okay, now, yeah, we, we actually, apparently there was an option there that Molly could have died, and we acted quickly enough and smartly enough to save her ass, so, okay, but, like I said, we had that same option with Carly as well. We chose to save we chose to save Carly and then she wound up getting killed. So I'm just saying, she's still not safe. Nobody's safe. Anything terrible could happen in any moment. <laughs> Have fun watching the rest of the episodes. See us.